That's right, guys. You can actually hear the motorcycles right now. I'm not sure if you could hear that, but it is going to be a little different this year. For the last 20 years, it's been based down in Fayetteville, but this year the home base is going to be right here in Rogers. Bikers are already gathering for the 2022 rally. The last two years were great. Even with uh, COVID, we, we put our show on and uh, had some great uh, participation. So we feel like this year is going to be one of the best ones ever. It's the first time since COVID started that everything is back to normal, except one thing. Uh, it just gives people a little closer avenue to go check out different locations. Uh, Fayetteville's great. I hope people still go check it out because there's a lot of cool businesses down there. and. Uh, the, the riding terrain's good, but it's just closer, you know, makes it more ideal. Instead of being based in Fayetteville, the home base will be in Rogers this year. It's the first time since Bikes, Blues, and Barbecue started nearly 20 years ago. We've been coming to Pig Trail Harley for the last 12 years to be part of this great event called Bike, Blues, and Barbecue. There have always been events and vendors throughout Northwest They're Arkansas, but this year, in something in new is revving up in Rogers. We uh, expect to get an uptick. I don't know what that looks like, but expect a little bigger uh, pool of people coming in. The event will officially kick off tomorrow morning at the Rogers Convention Center at 11 o'clock, where there will be plenty of dem demo rides available. Reporting in Rogers, Jacob Murphy, 4029 News.